this tutorial is about image processing. We will see how to apply a brightness effect to the image. This effect will be executed in the background thread and when the effect is applied we will use a handler to update the main UI, in other words to refresh the image. Let's see what we have in this example. So we have a seek bar that controls the brightness of the image. When the seek bar is moved, a new value for the brightness is sent to the background thread to be processed. Ok, let's go. In the main activity layout I have a linear layout with the image view and seek bar. Note that I have put max value for the seek bar to be 510. I also set its default progress to be 255. Reason for that is because we want values to be from minus 255 to 255. So actually when we slide the seek bar we just take the current value and subtract it with 255. So on that way we have both positive and negative values. Subtraction will be done in the seek bar listener. We can't set it right now here. Uh, next I just have an image in the drawable folder that will be used for testing. Go to the main activity and declare needed variables. Image view, bitmap and seek bar. Let's reference our picture with the bitmap factory dot decode resource method. Then use find view by ID to reference the image view and simply apply our bitmap to the image view. Don't forget to initialize the seek bar. We need to set on seek bar change listener so that we can get the current progress of it. Image processing is done in background thread, so let's create a new thread private picture thread thread initialize it in on create method and in its constructor pass the image view with the bitmap create this class picture thread let's initialize variables that are needed first we need the uh, image view and the bitmap that we have sent through the constructor then we are going to need a new bitmap used for canvas drawing. Next canvas, then paint. And now two variables that are most important, color matrix and color matrix filter. Color matrix class represents matrix that is used for transforming the color and alpha components of a bitmap. After that we need the handler. Handler will allow to update the main thread when the image processing is done in this background thread. Also we need the flag that is used for indicating the execution of the work. When the bool running is set to true it will do the processing otherwise it won't. Of course don't forget to extend the class with the thread. Uh, ok, let's initialize variables into the constructor that should be called only once. First we reference past image view and bitmap. Then we initialize a temporary bitmap with the create bitmap method using past bitmaps properties. Create a canvas and set this mutable temporary bitmap for drawing. Then initialize paint and handler. Implement this run method from the thread. 
okay now uh, what is needed is to create the setter for the color matrix uh, when we move the seek bar we will call this method and each time create a new color matrix with the desired brightness so let's create a method called adjust brightness that has an input parameter of brightness amount create a new color matrix new float array uh, I will just copy the matrix that is responsible for brightness adjustment we can't apply this color matrix directly to the paint that's why we need to use a color matrix color filter class very long name initialize it with the color matrix as input parameter now we can say paint dot set color filter and choose our color matrix okay uh, now we have everything set up we just need to process all this on the canvas uh, that processing is done in run method so in run method we type while true and next condition if running so what this means uh, it means that uh, the thread is always running but uh, it will only do the processing if the bool running is set to true if it is set to true we will apply our effect with canvas drawing so type in canvas dot draw bitmap and here we draw into the temp bitmap a received bitmap from the main activity alongside with the paint that has a color matrix for brightness adjustment after this line of code in our temp bitmap variable we have an image which brightness level is changed now in order to refresh the image of the main thread we will use handler so type handler dot post and apply temp bitmap to the image view don't forget to set bool back to false so that we don't get into the infinite loop we just forgot to set it to true so let's just make it true into the adjust brightness method so when we change uh, value of the seek bar now uh, go back to main activity start this thread into the onCreate method and we will simply call our adjust brightness method on the progress change of the seek bar and what is the amount as I said earlier values are from minus 255 to plus 255 so we will take the seek bar current value and subtract it with 255 that's it uh, let's see the result and as you see success thanks for watching see you in the next video bye